So Inside Out 2, I was very fortunate to be able to watch this with my family this week and I took a lot from it. I First of all, I just want to say to those who were in the cinema with me, it was a very small cinema, um, very intimate showing um, of the film and um, I'm not sorry but I fully appreciate that you didn't um, out me as being the most crying person ever. <laughs> I cried from the moment that film started to the end credits. Um, I, it resonated so much with me and I think I feel quite emotional now talking about it. A big thing for me is that how lucky are our children to have films like this? Because I'm in my 40s and the kind of films that we had were The Goonies, which, by the way, brilliant film. Um, but also things like Disney princesses, where the woman was never the really the powerful one. She was always looking to be saved and never really did we pay attention to emotions or safety. Uh, a big bugbear of mine, it's that term again, bugbear. Uh, when we're thinking about the films from our generation, safety was not part of the conversation, was it? Because these women were mostly sleeping or, you know, whatever. Um, anyway, um, what I absolutely love is that our children these days are given access to these just beautiful films and not only are our children getting access to it but we are as well because you cannot say that you can sit through a film like that and not learn something you know this is real basic emotional literacy emotional coaching stuff it's naming emotions recognizing emotions knowing oh i'm not weird that's not a negative thing that's a really big overwhelming feeling or emotion or experience and I'm okay I'm going to be able to pass through this I just need a little bit of a better balance and so uh, first of all the first thing is how brilliant that our children are able to watch these things and have access to these things I'm going to do a few more videos because I've got lots of thoughts on it um, but do share your thoughts if you've seen the film as well